This is Yuanda Canola. She is an engineer at the top of her game. She was a young women engineer uh, as per IT awards in 2012. A long time ago. A long time ago. But she's an international <laughs> engineering superstar. And she actually became an engineer because her mum thought it was a good idea. And this is Anne Marie Imavidon, like child prodigy, like super smart. Like she passed her A level exams at 10, I think it was 11. Yeah, but you were kind of nearly there, yeah, right? At 10. You were ready, 10, weren't yeah, you, right? Yeah. MBE, also, I can't forget that. I always need to include that. MBE, super smart, runs Stemets, and just an amazing, wonderful woman. Well, I became an engineer because Mom thought it was a great idea. Um, and she was right. I wanted to study architecture, but she thought, you know what, you'd be able to solve our world's problems. And I wasn't so sure of it. I, I, I didn't think it was, yeah. But then I did in the end, and no regrets today. I am absolutely happy I did. As a computer scientist, uh, which is kind of engineering, yeah. but I did it because I'm very creative and I like to solve problems. Mm. And for me, that's what computer science is about. The most interesting um, um, projects are pretty much like, you know, the ones that really challenge me. Um, I've worked on a couple of high-rise buildings in different parts of the world. Um, I really enjoyed um, working on a hotel uh, water park uh, project. And then my school projects, I absolutely love my school projects because they're slightly different um, and they're designed for the kids. And that's always a really nice touch. Um, so my favorite, if I have to choose of all time, is a database that I built when I was 10. Um, and I really like databases. <laughs> Yeah. No, that was my thing. Like, everyone else like, Mommy, I like databases. Anyone thinking about a career in engineering should come and join in. Join the party. Find your tribe. There's so many different events, uh, networks, people that you can meet to understand what it is because there's a lot of options. Look for the engineering everywhere. Like, when you walk down the streets, like, look for the engineering buildings and the pavement, like, in stores, everywhere. In shoes and in shoes, and yeah. Everywhere. Toothbrush. Take your pens apart and try and put them together. <laughs> There's springs, all kinds of stuff in there. Really cool. <laughs> <laughs>